Hey guys, it's Andrew from Effective Gamers. I'm here to start a new series on FTL, also known as Flash or... S I forget what it's called, but it's FTL. <laughs> okay, let's do new game. Confirm. Um, if you guys don't know what it is, um, well, I bought it on the Indie... Or on the Humble Indie 9 bundle. It is really worth the, um, money. Just this game alone, it's really fun. Anyways, we're gonna do accept. Um, yeah, we'll do this. We're gonna go with easy. Start. The data you carry is vital to the remaining Federation fleet. You'll no need supplies for the journey, so make sure to explore each sector before moving on to the next. But get to the exit before the pursuing rebel fleet catch up. I've already played this, so um, I know how this works and everything. So, um, yes, here's the lagging ship. It works, though. I mean, yeah, it, it works. I mean, yeah, it's way more fun when it's not lagging, but it's awesome. So, I, I really love this game. Um, let's turn it up. I don't know if you guys can hear it more than you can hear me, but I'm just gonna, you know. So here is um, upgrading the ship, the crew, I can dismiss the crew, and here's everything there. Um, upgrades, um, for right now, I'd like to upgrade this already. Uh, let's jump. If I don't make this game look good, I'm sorry, okay? But it is really fun, and it is so worth it. So, get it for five bucks, you get four games, six games, sorry, my bad guys. Um, but yeah, it's really awesome. I definitely rec rec egg, uh, recommend it. Um, everything is generated just based on this stuff, and it's just really fun. So, okay, you come out of the jump to see laser blast coming from the other side of the beacon, it looks like someone's under attack. I'm pirates, oh yes. You guys are gonna watch me fail, okay? No, just kidding. I'm all, I'm all right. So let's pause it just to look at the ship itself, and then look at our ship, and just determine what I'm going to do. So the burst laser is gonna take up a lot of energy, but it is way worth it to do that. So let's kick, click it twice so I can use it, and then I'm gonna see how it is taking out the guns now. We're just gonna go straight on for that thing. And then we're gonna go for it again. So, pause. Let's do this. This is all we can do, though. So, let's see how it does. Okay. If it could go any faster. Um, but I hope you guys enjoy this series as much as I enjoy this game. And I really love this game, so I hope you guys really enjoy it. Um... Yeah, let's just wait patiently. Hold on. Please don't pause. Oh my god, it paused. Whatever, hold on. Full screen, yes. Frame limit off. Gameplay. Um. Okay. That's good enough. So let's wait. Yeah, this is about the load time it takes for me to shoot it, so bear with me, guys. And that goes down to the ground. Uh, but this is a review. I'm not actually not going to start a series on it, so I'm just going to let you guys see it. It's really laggy and way too laggy for me to try and do a series on it. Oh, God. But, um... Yeah, I, I would have loved to do a series if I get like a way better computer I would be able to. <laughs> um, so I hope you guys enjoy this review. Um, the gameplay itself runs really smoothly. It's just when I'm recording, like right now, it's not very good because I can't really. It's just really laggy and doesn't work very well. Um, hold on. It would totally destroy this thing. Bam! Just like that. Okay, so, um, gameplay-wise, it is so fun. Um, 
even though it might not look fun to you, it is really fun for me. I get to move around my crewmates. Um, just everything's generated, and it's just really fun until... Even until... Oh, yes, please. Awesome. I got a new another crewmate, so we're gonna start moving these guys over. Um, but, yeah, that's just an example of a fight. It gets harder as you go through, but, um... I have these at the main stations that I need. Um, I hope you guys enjoy it, like I said for the millionth time. But, um, yeah, it's really fun. I definitely recommend it. The controls work perfectly. It's just fantastic. And, um, the plot of it, it's really, I mean, it's pretty, um, basic. I mean, yeah, they're trying to catch you. Okay, well, yeah. For that, I don't give it a very good rating on that. Um, but everything else is really awesome. Gameplay, which is the most important thing, is about a... I would say an 8.5. I just love it. Or, no, I'll say about a 7. 7.5, that's... That is what I'll rate it. Um, but overall, uh, graphics, it fits the game. Um... Like I said, some parts are not very, like, good. It kind of confuses me at parts. But, um, yeah. <clears throat> not really great review, but, um, the music, I like the music. I think it fits it. I think everything that's generated is fantastic. I think it is just a great game overall, and that is why I will be rating it a... I will be rating it an 8. Overall, overall, if that's counting everything, I will rate it an 8. Um, not one of my top favorite games, but it is definitely in my top, um, 5 indie games, so, yeah. Um, by the way guys, there will be a new indie game coming for the Humble Bundle, which I will be getting on Wednesday, I will be, uh, doing a re review on that. I'll also be doing a review on the rest of the game, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, 8 review. Uh, definitely go buy this humble bundle. It is definitely worth it. It's worth at least $100 total, so I definitely release or would buy it. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, even though I kind of said um a lot, and I kind of got sidetracked. Um, it's just really fun. I really love this game, and I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you on the far side.